The Duchess of Cambridge dazzled in a recycled 1,650 pounds coat dress this morning as she and William arrived in South Yorkshire for a busy day of engagements. The couple, who were expected to celebrate Prince Charles' 70th birthday celebrations at Buckingham Palace tonight, were all smiles as they touched down in Rotherham on Wednesday. Kate, 36, first wore the royal blue number from Eponine London, cut from double wool crepe and featuring a cinched in waist on a visit to a child bereavement UK centre in London last year, but she gave the look a fresh twist this morning with a £450 leather clutch from Smithson. The couple will officially open McLaren Automotive's new Composites Technology Centre in Rotherham this morning, before travelling to Barnsley's local Centre Point Hostel. While at the hostel, the Cambridges will meet with young people who are supported by the charity, of which William has been a patron since 2005 and visit their new learning hub. Rotherham's revamped McLaren Composites Technology Center will be used to innovate the process of designing and constructing lightweight carbon fiber tubs, which form the internal shell of all McLaren cars. The Duke and Duchess will today be shown the prototype manufacturing line that includes industrial processes for cutting and fitting carbon fiber. The carbon fiber car chassis produced here will then be assembled at McLaren's site in Woking, which William visited last year. William and Kate will meet those working in the £50 million factory in Catcliffe this morning and hear about plans for the centre's expansion that will provide 200 new jobs for the local area. Some of McLaren's STEM, Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics ambassadors will also be present at the event and will speak to the royal couple about their work encouraging children to get involved in science-based learning and careers. The Duke and Duchess will then travel to Barnsley where they will visit one of Centrepoint's services which supports over 60 homeless young people from the local area every day. Last year alone, some 7,000 young people in Yorkshire and the Humber approached their local authority because they were homeless or at risk. In Barsley, Centerpoint, who also counts Lady Kitty Spencer as an ambassador, is working to provide these young people with accommodation and support to get them back into education, training and employment. Kate and William will help prepare lunch in the kitchen before sitting down with residents to talk about their experiences. After lunch, the couple will visit Centerpoint's new Andy Norman Learning Hub which has been built to provide a dedicated space and resources for young people at risk of homelessness in Barnsley, and will enable them to improve their skills and move towards independence. The couple will have the opportunity to chat with those who use the Learning Hub before officially opening it.